What's up, YouTube? This is Two Raw for TV. So, I understand that the season is not over. There's still uh, some games remaining, and it's time for this team to rise and you know do all the stuff that everybody keeps saying is going to happen. You know, I heard Kyrie Irving say, "Look out for us after the break." You know, like they're going on this this amazing run which still hasn't yet materialized. We still haven't seen Ben Simmons come uh, back from whatever the fuck's going on with him and playing with the team. At this point, I'm going to go ahead and say it. When they're playing right now on TV, I don't care if they win or lose. At this point, the Kevin Durant Brooklyn experiment is a failure. It's a failure. Let's be honest. This team is not going to win a championship this year. They're just not. They're not going to win a championship, man. I'm sick of this these lies from the mainstream media where, like, this team is going to go on this magical run. Like, 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 for instance, Magic Johnson said, well, it's not over because back in 91, we went on a run the last two months of the season. Notice he said last two months of the season. Okay. We have about hmm, five weeks of basketball left, maybe. That day is done. And it's competitive as the Eastern Conference is, all these other teams are surging, you know what I'm saying, getting better. Brooklyn, no. Nah. They've been nothing but awful ever since the Christmas break. At least at the beginning of the year, they look like a team that could get to the, potentially the NBA Finals. Potentially. At one point. At least the Eastern Conference Final. Now, they may not even qualify for the playoffs. They may not. They're the AC right now. They're the AC. I think Charlotte's the ninth seed. Now, you, I would think they'll be able to beat them. But when you look at all of the firepower this team has, you got Kevin Durant, you got Kyrie Irving, you got Andre Drummond, you got. Uh, Lamarcus Aldridge, you got Blake Griffin, you got Patty Mills, you know, Seth Curry, you just acquired Goran Dragic. Now they have lost, um, you know, uh, Harris for the year. Okay. You just lost uh, Paul Millsap and James Harden in the trade, but you had his services for most of the year. That's a lot of fucking firepower. For a team that's 500. I don't want to hear about fucking injuries, man. You know, a lot of championship teams have dealt with injuries. A lot of championship teams have had key components hurt for long stretches of time. And they still was able to salvage their season. Like the Bucks. Okay? The Bucks have still been able to salvage their season. This team shows no... Not a not a, a a fucking a flash of being a championship team. And I think the real problem is this team has no fucking leaders. Steve Nash is not a fucking leader. Kevin Durant's not a leader. Kyrie Irving is not a leader. James Harden is not a leader. And, and and Philly will see that soon. And yeah, I have to come to the conclusion that this season has been a fucking failure and this will be a stain on Kevin Durant's legacy. At least it should be. But they're going to try to dump it on Kyrie. That's what the media going to do because they don't like Kyrie. They're going to try to dump it on him. But Kevin Durant still wanted 